This time around, I want to install Linux Mint 17.3 Cinnamon with January 2016, and I want to install it in VMware section. Not only I do I want it to install it, but I want to install it via USB, and that's a bit more tricky. You see, my USB is inside. This is the Linux Mint 17.3 Cinnamon 64. Question now is how to achieve that it boots not with a CD, a DVD, or a virtual DVD, but with an actual physical USB. We found a great article here on virgin.net how to USB boot in VMware Workstation 11. We are now at the Workstation 12, and uh, most of the settings, all of the settings, are the same. So, what should we do first off? let's not look at the right screen we should install our system so we can't do this one which is going from a virtual iso or a physical dvd so we'll do it later next linux ubuntu 64 bits is a great option but then you should rename it since it's not it's linux mint 70.3 and it's cinnamon that's our version next 20 gigabytes is enough in one file, please. Next, finish, close. That's phase one, that's not mentioned here. Now we go, we follow the points exactly, exactly. Am I edit virtual machine settings? Go to the options, which is here, to the advanced, boot with FE instead of BIOS. We are here. Let's scroll down, click OK, so save. In this case power on that's this button or that button right click the USB this is the USB disk icon here is an uh, other picture depends on what icon theme you're having so you have to wait for it and that's my USB jet flash mouse storage device I re remember the name so right click on the disk and then say this one okay power off the VM power off and then a bit tricky I would never have found it without this tutorial right mouse click power power onto firmware check and what will happen let's take this to, uh, next to it so now we have this here and as you can see we are so happy to see this line USB device just one enter away and we are booting actually from our USB here it is what do you want to do enter I will not show you the complete installation but just let's uh, just wait till you see the, the screen so you know that from that point on it's just the installation procedure as usual I'll put uh, the link from virtin.net in the YouTube link. This is a great, great link. I wanted to remember for the future as well. Remember, look down at to return to your computer, the, the left bottom text to return to your computer, press Ctrl Alt and I have my mouse back. So I can move from here to here and show whatever I want outside of our system VMware a lot of screens are open Voila. so we have now a Linux Mint 17.3 inside a Linux Mint 17.3 and we can uh, install it completely for starting from this icon here Okay, have fun with Linux.